Good morning. This is the fifth video in my flat.io series that we're putting together. And today, this is going to take you through um, their instruments tutorial. A couple things that we're going to be able to do in here. Uh, we'll be able to, something we already have done, uh, creating a score with instruments, but I'm going to show you uh, how to create your own. Uh, customize instruments, either something completely brand new or uh, from a starting point, uh, meaning to modify one of the instruments that's already in flat. Uh, and then once we're in there uh, into the score to match the instruments, show you how to add, remove, or change uh, any of the instruments that are in your score, how to rename the parts and or the abbreviations. Uh, a pretty cool feature for replacing so if you have a tuba part in, uh, we'll be able to replace that for an electric bass part. And uh, also show you how to add or remove staves from an instrument. And um, yeah, that's what we're going to do. So first thing I'll show you is how to create your own customized instrument. I'm going to start a new score. We'll call this uh, Custom Instruments. I already have a couple of these set up, but I'm going to show you how to do one uh, from scratch. Um, let's do, I'll just create a score that has a French horn in it and a tuba. Okay, here we are. And in, uh, if you go up to the top right where your logo is, your picture, and you go to account settings, over on the left, the bottom uh, icon, it'll say instruments. If you click on that instruments, um, right now, I've already created the bass trombone. Actually, I'll delete this and I'll show you uh, how I created that. So when you click on instruments, uh, you'll click on create an instrument. And I'll create the bass trombone, the king of the orchestra. Uh, that is a pitched instrument. And your bass type allows you to pick a pre-existing instrument inside of flat already. So I went into the brass family and selected trombone. Uh, you also have the option to build this completely up from zero if this is something uh, unique. Uh, but for our purposes right now, we're just going to be dealing with uh, the bass trombone, which you can modify from the trombone patch over here. Uh, over here, this does read in bass clef. And if you wanted to add uh, multiple staves to the instrument, you could do that there. It's a non-transposing instrument, and it sounds where it's written. This instrument does not use a tab, so we can continue. And the instrument, uh, you could pick anything, uh, but we're still going to use the trombone patch that comes with flat. <coughs> Excuse me. And then over here, the name, we would just modify to bass trombone, and then whichever abbreviation you would like to put. You can save the instrument, and that's done. So if I go back to, oops, go back to my scores. Oh, here is my library, sorry. Uh, from here, um, I'm going to go in and I'm going to add bass trombone in, into this score. To do that, I can click on any of these instrument names, and that's going to take me to this instrument settings window. On the instrument settings window, you can, uh, just like in Finale or Sibelius, you can just click and drag these to uh, reposition. And you also have a little box there that says to add an instrument. And up here in your custom instruments, is going to be the one we just created. Put that in the middle. And you can see over here, uh, it's giving you the preview of the score for how the parts are going to look. And that's that. Uh, within this window, this is where you also have the opportunity if you click on edit um, to modify these parameters. Uh, maybe if you're customizing for individual names or whatever you want to do, the staves, uh, tablature, uh, you know, that's that stuff is all for you right there if you need it. 
<clears throat> All right, let's get back into this. Okay, um, another feature that, uh, that that's shown right here is the replace. So if you had uh, parts in for tuba, and it turns out that, I, I don't know, that you need that part done now for electric bass. Uh, you could add an electric bass into your score, copy and paste the parts, of course. Uh, oh, excuse me. Replacing. Uh, if I take this and I go to pluck strings and I change this to um, electric guitar or electric bass, you'll see that the bass comes uh, default with the tablature option. So I would go in there, go to edit, and underneath tab, I would just turn off, use a tablature, save that, and then you can see that's now modified and the score looks the way that it does. So again, this is more for starting and getting set up, but uh, that's how you can create new instruments in flat, like the bass trombone, the king of the orchestra, uh, and then how you can uh, modify how they show up in your score and or uh, replacing instruments. Okay, hope this was helpful.